In the Civil Engineering Department at Ryerson University in Toronto, Ontario, Lamia Amley conducts large-scale experiments on construction materials for bridges and roads to understand how they behave under different conditions. With the help of a corroding tank, Amley's students test the effects of corrosion on steel and the impact this has on the surrounding concrete. Spalling is the coming down of those concrete pieces under the soffit of the deck. Spalling off actually happens due to the dela uh, delamination between the steel reinforcement and the concrete and what happens corrosion attacks the steel so when it swells up the pressure that is coming out of this uh, reinforcing steel will be uh, higher than the tensile strength of our concrete structure so it cracks the data from these tests helps researchers measure how rapidly the deterioration occurs so they can develop rehabilitation and retrofitting techniques to preserve our infrastructure it also helps them come up with optimal design practices to increase the service life of new structures. A coffee maker, we can buy it for $30. And with that coffee maker, we always have a huge book about how to maintain our coffee maker. However, we built billions and billions of dollars of, of bridges and, and transportation systems, and we don't have anything to tell us how to maintain it. Our practicing engineers do not know how to even check it if it is sick or if it is healthy. Emily implements the study of maintenance and rehabilitation into her curriculum. Her courses teach undergraduate students to assess bridge and road conditions and to think in terms of design sustainability. Now hopefully uh, with the new generation of, of those practicing engineers rather than saying it this is the way we do it. No, this is the way we learnt. I want them to have a mindset that we have, whenever we are designing something, we have to design a maintenance program for it and with it.